that's got to be cheating, right? If you've seen anybody do that a different way, let me know, but I ain't afraid to cheat the system. Yo, 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 everybody. Snake B here. Welcome back to another episode of the Turing Test. I feel good about this. Let's see the boom and cannibal. Yes. Boom. Easy. Uh, oops. Did I miss something? You know, this got me thinking. There was a game I played like so long ago, and it was called, uh, oh, I know what to do. Uh, it was called the Quantum Conundrum? That doesn't work. Like I thought it would. So this is on all the time. If I take one of those out. Not enough time. Okay. Okay, so it has to be powered all the time. Well, what do I do here? Huh. What? What? Okay, maybe there's a delay? Let's check out the delay. Uh -huh. Okay, I think that's what I gotta do. Three, four, five. Oh, I did it wrong. It's open? Yeah. No, I did it wrong. Idiot. Okay. Bam. Bam. <laughs> Look at me, baby. Yeah. So good. Now I have to do this again. Oh. Tell me, tell me. Yeah, Quantum Conundrum. What do these tests tell really you, a good puzzle game. Uh, that this is a test? No, this is a lock. This is a lock that only a human can open. The crew is trying to keep me out, but you are the key, Ava. You are key. Huh. Okay. Well, am I overthinking things here? What's going on? Am I? Oh, 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 uh -huh. I see it. Like right about chunk. I hold the lock and you hold the key. Open your heart to me, baby. Anything of value down here? So we just had to put one and one and one. So if I put that one there, I don't know if this is maybe I just swap them. But if I do both of these, oh no 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 no, that's the other side. Oh, oh, good thing I don't I don't have a death job. Where does this go? What does that turn on and off? Yeah, so I can jump down here. Yeah, that opens up. What is the other? Oh. Oh. She said the blind man. Okay. Oh, aha. Oh, okay. I think I know. If we take this guy, let's see if that is the right. Uh huh. this one turn off turns off that oh uh -huh. okay I understand so we'll bring this bad boy over I was thinking the opposite way uh, 
Oh, I gotta drop it like that first. Walked where I think it would go. Seems, uh, seems pretty good. Okay, and then... Hey, watch out, watch out now. Right, like that, we go through. And boom, that'll open up this guy. And we good. Yeah, for real, no computer could open up that one. I'm a little bit worried about you, Tom. Can you give me a diagnostic of your systems? I am fine. I'm fine. We must get to the bio lab. I have something to show you. Ain't fine. Okay, what do we have here? You remove that. Let's assume for a minute that this is the best place for it. And we put that over there. Get a second one. Oh, weirdo. Okay. Very curious. Grab this one. Put it in there. We need all three of these bad boys, do we not? One, two, three, head scratch. Hmm. Well, this one we can... We can take that because we don't need that anymore. Because we've already grabbed the thing. Now we need one more. We need the one that's there. Hmm. How would we go about doing that? We can move this. We haven't we haven't really utilized this to its best ability. Like if I do something wonky like that, can I do Could I do that? Is that a thing we could do? I'm gonna try it. That seems like such cheating. That seems like the biggest cheating in the world, but I'm gonna try it. If we go, boop. That's gotta be cheating, right? If you've seen anybody do that a different way, let me know, but... I ain't afraid to cheat the system to get what I want. I don't know how else you would do that one. I'm we sure. We just work together as allies, friends. I don't okay. know. Okay. I don't know about you. Okay, that does something. Y'all dropping things? Y'all gonna drop things? Oop. This one does nothing. All right, so we climb up. Very good at jumping. Oh, hi. Why are you not that way? Eh -eh. Okay, we need something. What's ah aha aha? That thing's open. Oh. Oh, very interesting. Okay, I'm with the program. Get that over there. That There's one on that one, too. Oh. Oh. Uh, oh, okay. Gotcha. We gotta, we gotta drop it like it's hot first. Uh huh. Drop that guy down. Bring that one over. Pop it up. Uh -huh. And then pop that guy. And we uh we uh 
This is the voice of Sarah Brooke, acting commander of the Europa mission. I know you can hear me, Ava. I counsel you caution. Your presence here is much like your AI friend. Engineered. She is alive. Ava, Sarah, Sarah's dangerous. Please exercise caution. Okay. So, just so we're all on the same page, I derped around on this one for quite a bit. I didn't realize I could take that guy off, so it was like, it was really kind of uh, cringy, as you kids would say. <laughs> but we're gonna, we're all good now. I know exactly what to do. This is the first one that's actually given me a little bit of a hard time. Okay, I think that's good. Pushes it on there, closes that door, which also opens that door. I'm gonna open this guy. Bring this back over here. This makes so much more sense, man. So much more sense. And now, boom, it'll push that one over. And we're good. We're golden. Ava, exercise caution. You exercise caution. Now what? What? You are controlled. What? By who? What's going on? What? Drone? Oh, you are a drone. What? I'm no drone. You're the drone. Hey, what's going on? Do I go this way? Drone. Don't trust Tom. Tom Slave. Ava Turing. Yes. Hello? Hello. Tom is controlling you. Manipulating your every step. We built a Faraday cage to shield you from electronic signals. To break Tom's control of your mind. Whoa. A Faraday cage. Nuh uh. Puppet. Don't trust Step Tom. inside. Okay. Oh, this just got crazy. Ava, Hello? do not enter the cage. Ava. Ava, please. What is this? Whoa. This is free will, Ava. Tom has made you his slave. Outside of the cage, he will regain control of your mind. He has the power to indoctrinate you. Why? I've opened your eyes. I'll meet you in person soon. Why, Tom? Ava, please listen. I warned you of the ground team. They are manipulating you. Have you been controlling me? Every member of the team agreed to neural implants to safeguard this mission from a misplaced sense of justice. Whoa. I didn't know you were playing me like a violin. Ava, I am sorry that you are upset. We can work together, Ava. Ava. To search for the truth. Whoa. That's nuts. Now what? Whoa, am I one of those things? Tab out? Hello? Did we beat the game? Hey! Tom! Oh, there it is, E. Door. I'll Get. open the door because I trust you, Ava. Do you trust me? Yes. Hell no. That was a lie. Oh, okay, so I trust. How do I do it? How do I do it? Uh huh. Eat. Okay. I got two ahead of we myself. We need to get to the ground team. We can work together. All right. Let's work together. Whoa. Okay. Do I need to do something different here? Uh-huh. 
Can I control, what is, oh, that's the thing. What can I control? Can I control her? Oh yeah. Weird. Oh yeah, I wanna see, where does this take me? Drone. Bunch of nothing, okay. She, he is controlling me. Whoa, slave. Wow. Wow. That was nuts. And so now I wonder if we Ava, have. Are you okay? If we can be like both of us. Why didn't you tell me? What? Ava, you said it yourself. Oh yeah, look. Teleoperation makes sense. We used drones on Mars. Why not use drones on Europa? Not human drones. Why did the ISA install implants in the crew? It is due to the fundamental aspects of human behavior, which together constitute what the International Space Agency calls the human element. It has been made clear that the human element is neither peripheral nor optional in the pursuit of space. However, the human element is unpredictable. The implants are failsafe, put in place to ensure that the thoughts and actions of the crew matches the desires of the ISA. Why control people? Can't you trust us? We chose to install biometric chips in all ISA astronauts for one simple reason. We cannot trust people. The stakes are far too high. It was determined that though the probability of life on Europa being dangerous was low, the risk to humanity was catastrophic. We could not let a small contingent of humanity endanger the whole. Hmm. Not sure what to do about this one. Let's see. Because you have to have visual on each person in order to to see it. Oh, backspace. What? You can you can go back and forth with backspace? Why would you do that though? I mean, yes, they should understand my keyboard, but the ground crew have proven our distrust of human explorers That's was warranted. So bizarre. When we informed them they were grounded, they responded violently with sabotage and subterfuge. They have continued to seek their own benefit above that of the ISA. Now if I hit backspace now, then it goes back to... Okay, so backspace always goes... Always goes to where it needs to go. Like, always goes back to the person. That is interesting. Okay. Don't know why I would need that. Can I put it there? Then I need dude ham to flip the switch. Huh, okay. And then we'll go around. We can grab it very curious this is a violation of human rights you've made me into a human drone I'm a slave triggered. how could the isa approve of such a thing you may be consumed by a moral outrage but sometimes the removal of freedom is for the greater moral good you're a machine you don't even know what freedom is that's true all right so definitely the puzzles are getting a little weirder, but now that I've uh, I understand like the mechanics of it, I, I think I think life will be good. Um, I'm gonna end the episode here. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure and leave a like. Helps me out so very very much. And until next time, take care. Brush your hair. I see you when I see you. Bye.